cup in my foot and it's dry again and go pangan the sun is coming through today i think it's still a little bit cloudy but yeah after rain comes sunshine you know <laughs> that is not only for the weather but everything for everything in life about bitcoin guys today bitcoin is hovering around 7750 which i already stated in the video yesterday you know the 8000 long term resistance level is near and uh, we need to break it uh, if we don't break it we can have a 20 percent drop or 30 percent drop even down so it's very important we need to break this resistance at the same time you can read a lot of news about whales are not preparing to sell about like 43 percent of the whales has been hauling their bitcoins for more than two years and about 22 percent of the whales has been hauling their bitcoins for more than five years what i mean with hauling at the moment is they have not moved their bitcoins out of their wallet for more than five years or two years this is really cool this shows their trust in bitcoin at the same time i already talked about yesterday you know the uh, the google search engine is getting crazy out of the bitcoin surges because it's growing parabolic the bitcoin halving surge at the same time we can see um, the all-time high in will wallets at the all-time high in 0.1 bitcoin wallets with other words many bullish shines for the long term and up and it will take another i think 10 days 12 days uh, 12 days till the halving i think uh, so really exciting times because the year after the halving has been proven to be a very exciting year with a nice bull run ethereum and litecoin are showing buy signals as well ethereum could um, break the resistance around 198 then we could see ethereum back at 217 dollars litecoin also um, showing a weekly buy signal now and which is really cool because litecoin has often often took a lead in the bull runs bitcoin was first litecoin started to run and then bitcoin came after so keep watching litecoin because if that one starts running the chance is big bitcoin will run as well if it comes to trading you know we need exchanges and at the moment uh, there are two exchanges that have some problems qcoin qcoin is uh, was in court in singapore and qcoin lost the control of the domain qcoin.com the singapore court took control of this domain which again is the reason we should go to unstoppable domains and maybe even decentralized exchanges so they are can, cannot be stopped by courts governments or any other central organizations we also saw bitfinex now closing its services for the japanese market from the first of may because bitfinex doesn't want to face the regulation in japan this is also sad news for bitfinex and qcoin but again shows us that we need to start supporting decentralized exchanges and start supporting um, decentralized unstoppable domains if it comes to decentralized exchanges i would love you to tell me which decentralized exchange you have tested and which ones you like please leave a comment below in the next video i will talk about the decentralized exchanges i have tested and which one i like but first i want to know which one you like and preferred and which one you're still using or what the reason is why you are not using it there is also a poll somewhere here you see this eye this poll you can answer the question so we can check how many people have used decentralized exchange some really cool news for the banks the banks have tremendous losses in the first quarter hsbc bank from the uk has had a drop of 50 percent in their profits which is huge i think they are laying off 35,000 people so 35,000 people will lose their job because of this drop and then we have santander's bank from spain who stated they lost eight they had an 82 percent drop in their profits which is huge and again people please understand you think the banks are safe but banks have been proven in the in the past that they are not as safe as you guys think 
in the Netherlands we had a bank that collapsed I think it was called the DSB bank and there are many banks around the world that already collapsed and we have some huge banks at the moment that won't survive this economical crisis or we just need to start printing more and more and more, and more fake money but even then they will be in huge problems because of this crisis so banks are losing big time at the moment so take control of your money make sure that a part of your assets is in cryptocurrency uh, bitcoin or even in gold or silver whatever you see as a safe haven for me it's bitcoin i don't know what the safe haven is for you but just check out the bitcoin because i think this economical crisis will show the true strength of bitcoin please take a look at venezuela they are a big example what could happen to the value of dollar of euro of uh, thai baht of any other currency around the world the people in venezuela now have a minimum wage of two dollars per month two dollars per month the promise of the president was thirty dollars per month and he will probably upgrade it in the next couple of months to $30 a month but realize that there are people living of $30 a month in other parts of the world that's two big back menus menus and a happy meal for you guys and those people live off this money for a month so yeah the monetary system has its flaws and um, but that's why we try to change it as a community and hopefully we can all use this crisis to wake up and to change this monetary system for the better but not only the monetary system also the mindset because if we are talking about the new normal i think it all comes to the mindset and to the beliefs of people i think we need to start to become less materialistic more minimalistic and really start to care for each other again because before you know it they lock you up again and uh, you have no control of your life so I think together we need to stay strong and protect our civil rights, human rights, freedom and all other things that are important to us as a community. I have some amazing news because I'm now featured on Everypedia. Everypedia is also called the wiki encyclopedia for everything, everyone, everywhere. This is a really cool site, check it out everypedia i am featured on it i will put the link of to my um, everypedia page below uh, you can find a lot of knowledge from all people over the world on this beautiful new kind of wikipedia but then built on a beautiful blockchain so check everypedia at the same time i um, was invited to become a brave content creator i started to use the brave browser as well i love the speed of it i love that i don't see all the advertisement and i love that i'm now making cryptocurrency by browsing the internet or by creating amazing content and receiving tips from other brave browser users um, it's built um, you're being tipped in bat so you know this uh, this currency is being traded on centralized but also a lot of decentralized exchanges so check them out i will put the link uh, below as well because i think um, it's really cool that they are changing the way content creators uh, but also people that spend time on the internet are now being incentivized in cryptocurrency so um, thumbs up for brave um, check them out guys this was the news for of today um, I don't have much much more news keep your eye on Bitcoin keep your eye on ethereum keep your eye, keep your eye on Litecoin if you're a trader because we are nearing resistance and um, you know we are nearing the halving and we are seeing a lot of growth in many uh, indicators be turning positive so please keep an eye on your cryptos because now is the time that it's getting really excited thanks for sharing the video thanks for watching the video guys i wish you all an amazing day uh, i would love it if you uh, like the video if you share the video if you subscribe to my channel uh, we the channel has been growing tremendously since i started to make these daily videos thank you for watching the videos thank you for already subscribing to me and thank you for commenting because i love to have interaction with you guys because that is what we 
makes me truly happy if I see a community that not only watches the video but also understands the content or even questions the content because I might learn a little bit from you guys as well. I wish you an amazing day. Uh, live this day to the fullest. Enjoy every moment of this day because before you know it, um, you will be locked down and it will be a little bit more difficult to enjoy life. And most important guys, the YouTube channel has been growing tremendously the last two weeks since I've been making these uh, daily videos. I'm really thankful that you started to follow us. I'm really thankful that you already started to share our content. I'm really thankful for all the likes and I hope you keep following us and please start to comment below the videos because I love to have interaction with you guys so that we can educate you in maybe even becoming this also decentralized digital Bitcoin nomads. You can live life where you want, how you want and spend currencies in any kind of way. If you want to become a digital Bitcoin nomad, check our website, thebitcoinfamily.com. There's a lot of information on there. Um, you can even find the links to our books that, we, that, we, that I wrote. And you can find the course over there uh, to start uh, trading in crypto. Uh, there is a lot of information on thebitcoinfamily.com. Just make sure to check it out. And in every video, I put a lot of links in the descriptions. These are not just links to make money, but also links to help you guys because they are all amazing projects and apps that can simplify the use of Bitcoin for you guys and that just help the whole crypto community with taking this whole technology technology to the next level. Thanks for watching.